Well, Gary, uh, we go to well, we know we go. We've got Epsley here Saturday, a tough game, and uh, the team we've already played this season and lost to. Uh, do you know exactly what to expect from them? Well, I've had a change of manager since she, uh, <coughs> since we played them at their place. Um, change of formation and you know personnel and stuff like that. So um, when we get the team sheet, we'll be we'll be prepared. And Gary Hill as well, you're looking forward to uh, renewing rivalries with him, a very experienced manager at this level. Yeah, he's, he's experienced, um, he does a good job wherever he goes, you know, he gets good players, he gets his, his teams organised, so uh, it'd be nice to catch up with him before and after, but during, he'll want to win it and so will I, so uh, it'd be nice to catch up with him after. Obviously you've, uh, you've rubbed shoulders as teams of, as managers of rival teams as well, so a little bit of added spice to the fixture, I guess? Well, I don't think so personally. Um, but he'll know what to expect coming here. Obviously, being the manager of Woking, so uh, look, he's, a, he's a good football man, it's as simple as that. So um, his team will be prepared and so will ours. So uh, we'll look forward to the challenge. And then we uh, last week obviously was a negative result, but what a performance Tuesday night from the boys? They've, they certainly. They don't lack the character to have a fight, do they? In these in these tough games. Yeah, they responded really, really well against you know tough opposition. So we have to be more consistent with that. Uh, we keep uh, talking about that, um, you know, inconsistency and stuff like that. So we just have to make sure that we turn up and give a good account of ourselves, especially in front of our home home supporters. Is that the target then going into the second half season? This is the first, the first team we would have played twice now to iron out those inconsistencies we had certainly more towards the beginning of the season. Hopefully, yeah, but you know, we keep stating the fact that we're a young group and you know, if you looked at the average age of our group compared to some of the teams that we're up against, we're very, very young and sometimes it lacks uh, that experience uh, and know how, but um, you only get that by playing games and being in, you know, good periods and bad periods. You learn a lot during the, the, the bad periods more so than the good periods and our group of players are learning all the time. A bit of a depleted group at the moment as well with all the injuries you had. Uh, you said it was like an episode of Casualty Tuesday night. Has um, anything changed tonight? Has anyone got better? It could be a fully fit squad for all you know. Well, let's wait and see. <laughs> <laughs> and then, um, yeah, obviously test ourselves against Ebb's fleet. You mentioned we're a young group. They're a group that's a lot of them, they're in their prime of their career. They've got a good core of players, a good squad. They were all promoted together a couple of years ago. Obviously, they were here in the playoffs last year and, and got the result that we all didn't want. But, yeah, good test. Yeah, massive test for us, you know. <coughs> they're an experienced outfit. they got some really good players uh, within their group. And, you know, it doesn't matter who, you know, walks out on Saturday for them. It'll be an experienced group, you know. So, uh, it's a big challenge for us, but one that we're all looking forward to. Okay, we'll choose your time. Thank, thank you. you. Good luck. Okay, thank you. Cheers.